Hey everybody, this is Ben, and welcome to Big Pharma. Now, if you've uh, been looking around YouTube in the last uh, probably day or two, I'm sure you may have seen a lot of people getting this game, starting to play it. Uh, it's a brand new uh, indie game, just came out on beta. Uh, it's available at uh, bigpharmagame.com. For purchase, you get access to the beta, and you get a Steam key, because they are going to be released on Steam sometime soon. But uh, despite the probably surge of videos that are going to be available for this game, I watched just a tiny bit of it and thought it looked super cool. Um, it's pretty much like, um, I would say it's like a tycoon game where it's essentially a pharmaceutical tycoon that, you know, it's pretty standard. You build a factory and you gotta, you know, turn a profit and everything. So I went through the tutorials already. So we're gonna jump right into the beginner uh, challenges, I guess they're called, scenarios, whatever. Um, and I can kind of just give a, try to give a brief explanation of how it's all working in the event that you're not familiar already haven't already watched six hours of uh, <laughs> of this game being played so let me see here so bottom line objectives earn a revenue of uh, they need some commas there looks like a million dollars within 10 years so let's oh oh I get to name my company name your company um let's go with Uh, I'm gonna go with, stick with my standard and say Whoa Bro Co. All right, Chief Executive o o Officer Leonard, Jenny. I wish they had, they have to have stats or something. Chan, you do not look like a uh, CEO, dude. Like, oh, okay, you're kind of nerdy. Oh, and there we go. There's the that's the you look like a CEO-ish sort of guy. You look like a vet. Who is that? Was Penny? Oh gosh, Barclay looks like he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna break some kneecaps to make that million dollars. Um, Tess and oh Leonard. Um, let's go with. Huh. Leonard, you do not look like a CEO. Jenny, you don't look like you. None of these people look like a CEO. All right, we are Orion. What a name. All right, I'll go with Orion. Sure. All right, great. So I need to earn a million dollars before 1st of January 25. Complete within five years for rank master. All right, so we're, that's our goal. Five years. We're going to try to beat the clock. So 1st of January... Um, 20. Got it. All right, so cool. Let's, um, I don't know about, pause the time real quick. Do I have like keys for those? No, all right, anyway. Um, so what we gotta do is we gotta make some drugs, some pharmaceutical grade drugs. So let's look at, uh, I think we'll start with the cures here and take a look at what we have available to us. Demands antihistamine, 1342. So over here you gotta grab, I, I'm not super, familiar with exactly what these graphs are determining? I mean, it looks like there's some fluctuation in demand. Oh, seasonal, of course. Seasonal fluctuations for demand. All right, cool. Soothe cough. That's that's a good... Okay, we're going to go with the soothing cough. Um, so we need... Um, where does it tell... Oh, okay. Well, I'll, I'll figure out what the ingredient is. So we're going to pick that one. We need to use the... Uh, oh, we can already do the soothing... Okay. And you can do the agglomerator. I don't have an agglomerator, do I? So I'm going to have to... You start out with a few machines here. Here we go. The dissolver, the pill printer, um, basic pharma stuff, evaporator. So you have one... This evaporator, it concentrates the drugs, and then the dissolver decreases the concentration. And then we have exploration. All right. Um, probably don't need to worry about exploration too much right now. So let's go over to ingredients. What do we say when we do the soothes cough, right? Induces nightmares. Oh my god. Uh, soothes cough. Prompts sleepiness. Oh, okay. So we got. All right, let's let's do this. So we're gonna take bitter matiara extract. Sure. And soothes cough. Oh wow, that's a good profitable one there. One twenty nine. All right, cool. This is gonna be an easy one. So let's. 
uh, so we assign these little ports. Uh, you can assign the ingredient to come into one of those. There we go. So then we'll grab a belt. You gotta have a belt between each thing to connect it. So you can see there, we'll have, uh, should have our little ingredient pop in. All right. Um, so what did we see? I can click on this. Let's use conf. We need to, um, we need to decrease the concentration. Currently inactive. So you can see here, these are both listed as inactive. This little highlighted bar shows where the current concentration is. So these are both inactive. This is a, the red one's a side effect, and this is our primary um, primary effect that we're looking for. So we just need to decrease the concentration by one. So let's go ahead and uh, that's. I guess I'll put that there and then grab some belts. All right, Allison, where's my ingredients? Oh, it's paused. That's right. You can build while paused. All right, cool. So let's see here. Okay, so that each, I think each belt movement is a day. Yep. Yeah, so each belt movement is a single day in the time. So it's, you know, it's a speed up, sped up simulation. Great. So now you can see Sood's cough has been highlighted as activated. Um, and also prompt sleepiness, but that's not a big deal. But then before we can sell this, we, oh, we don't have a creamer. We can turn it into, turn it into a soup and cream, but we have a pill printer. Uh, and pill printers, uh, since I have gone through the tutorial, uh, let's see, I'll put like that. Let's see, so any, any port you haven't assigned an ingredient to is an output port, so that's easy enough. Just drag and put our belt there, and then drag. There we go. Uh, pill printers run like half speed compared to most other machines. Converting finished ingredient into a pill, so it costs 20 bucks. Wow. So yeah, each of these things you can see it moves, blink 10 bucks, and 20 bucks in each of those. And now we're finally. There we go. We got some pills coming out, and when they go out the door, boom. We get a new product. Whoa, whoa, bro. Coffees. Um, coffees. Sure, I, I'm not. Oh, I got so many names. <laughs> Every product is gonna need a name. But so, Suits Cough 129. We're gonna go ahead and hit name. And bang, there we go. 149. Every time one of the pills goes out the door. And you can be able to see that the. Uh, Oh, here we, here we go. We have a report. New AI product. Uh oh. Barclay Cough Reliever in direct competition with our product, Robo Coffees. Oh, here, let's check out their company. Uh, so they're selling six per month at 85 profit. And they have a QC cure rating. Oh, never mind. That's us. Okay, that, and the sold per month is going up. That's. Oh, the cure rating is a D. Six narcolepsy episodes. Oh my gosh. There, uh, so it's copper. Okay, right, so theirs looks pretty well the same. Ours is slightly less valuable because of the narcolepsy. <laughs> but that's okay, that's okay. Um, anyway, so let's go back to our production area. So you can see here we have just this one tiny area of factory floor. We can buy more, which I am going to do because I have $45,000 and money coming in. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at cures. What else do we have here? Actually, let's let's get someone looking for new ingredients. Um, so here we go. This one, Dragon Beetle. Forest areas don't require specialist teams and are relatively unhazardous. So that's good. Find an ingredient with applications within liver medication. So something with the Dragon Beetle can help livers. So we need one explorer. And you can see here, it tells me how many I've got. So I'm gonna hire an explorer. So now I've got one, cost me 50 bucks a day, but I'm making more than that. So we're still turning a profit. So I'm gonna assign them over there. Um, you could really, I, I'm making a million dollars. Doesn't seem like that much, um, but we're just gonna, we're gonna just keep expanding production. So what else we got here? We've done this one. The purified Fortis sap is an antihistamine. Great. 
Oh, we can upgrade this one to alleviates insomnia. We have that machine. We don't have the agglomerator, but we have a dissolver. Hmm, interesting. All right, so let's import this one. And I'll stick it up there, and we'll try to output down this bottom side. So. Oh, I'm too far out. Oh, cool. So we need to decrease that, but then if we go to four to, what are we at currently? Nine. So we need to decrease a bunch to get the alleviates insomnia effect. Hmm, uh, let's actually, how much is the alleviates insomnia? It's 318, ooh, nice. Nice, I'm going for that. Uh, so grab a belt. Increased concentration. Um, yes, yeah, so put one there. One there. It's gonna be a little bit pricey, all of this construction. A bunch of conveyor belts. We have a bunch of days of buffering before this is gonna get made. So after this, we find it is in the. We want four to six. Oh man, so it's gotta go lower. Let's, ah, uh, how much of a refund do I get on these things? All right, I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just gonna keep bl blundering along. Um, so after that, what are we down to? We're down to a seven and we need a six. Okay, so come out of here and then another dissolver will turn it into alleviates insomnia. So we're gonna go there. And then another dissolver. We're just, let's just pack it in. Let's pack it in. It's nice and snug. All right, so. When it comes through here, then we gotta get a regular pill printer set up. Two of those. Get that output. All right, so here. Is that not? Hmm. I guess I need a belt on the other side. Like so. Put that there. And that there. All right. Cool. So now this should. Oh God! I have that backwards. <laughs> That's the problem. All right. Ah, I'm deleting some of my stuff. All right, dissolver, let's try that again. There we go. There we go, okay, cool, cool, cool. We're good. Now we're gonna start getting some alleviating insomnia effect. I think, actually, I better delete that because this isn't always so straightforward. Oh, look at that. Oh look! Oh, this is this is rough. That's rough. Okay, I gotta I gotta get some research going. This is gonna kill me. I need. Um, let's see here. Uh, where is it? National headquarters? Oh, interesting. Uh, I need I need the agglomerator. I think it is. So I need I need both of these actually. Ionizer. Because that reduces the concentration by th three. Uh, scientists are only 30 bucks. The scientists are cheaper than the explorers. Um, okay, um, I, that doesn't matter. I, I need both, really. I could, I could almost research. Yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's, let's research them both. I'll get them at the same time. Okay, check out company. Do we have like a, like a, a graph of our... Profitability? That would be nice. I don't see anything. Bones, too. Okay, never mind. I don't. What's this? Ingredient discovered. Sweet. Continental bipoxy solution. Uh, prevents gout. Oh, interesting. And it causes constipation and fatigue as well. Uh, we might. Oh, and this is this is getting complex now. This is getting complex. So let's look at our ingredients. We've got that. Does that fall into the liver section on cures? 
Suits cough. Liver. Yep. Prevents gout. Combats liver disease. Um, all right. Let's go back to our factory floor. I think I've been over ambitious. What is this? Sneeze beater. Interesting. Uh, all right. So, alleviates insomnia. I need to go to 11. Oh my gosh. I can't do this. I can't. I can't make it to this one. Crud. All right. So, what does this thing do? It's an antihistamine. Uh, all this money. R&D, right? R&D. Well, let's just delete it all. Ah, uh, yeah, whatever. We'll, we'll rebuild the whole production line, everybody. Sorry, it's a bust. Close that one out. All right, here we go. So let's try this again. Let's just get the end histamine and be done with it. So import that. There we go. So yeah, you can also import things just by clicking on there and picking one. All right. Uh, so this we just need to decrease the concentration by one. <laughs> oh gosh, so much easier. I would have been so much better off. Let's grab a couple of pill printers and do like that. There we go. Oops. Belts, belts, belts. There. Easy peasy. <laughs> oh, so painful. I have tons of, like, uh, factory floor available. I could make this setup more space efficient if I swap the inputs and outputs there, too, I just realized. Because of the way the dissolver is oriented. Anyway, let's see how I'm coming on my objectives. Oh, not super great. Not super great. And we're low on money. Um... Oh, what's this? Oh, new product. My new product is done. Robo's sneeze. Robo no chew. <laughs> Come up with goofy names for this stuff. I should actually, what I should be doing is coming up with the most ominous sounding name I possibly can. Nice. All right, so now we've got another revenue stream. Excellent. That that will help with uh, our our explorer. So two of them for this. Four, five. Yeah, you keep requiring. Oh, then you have to do re more research to even get that. All right, let's see how our research is coming. Uh, Seventy percent ish on both of those. Great. So let's let's ah. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna fire that explorer. <laughs> oh, never mind. Actually, because uh, they give me ingredient upgrade points, so I can upgrade these things, and it decreases the cost of the initial upgrade. That might be that might be worthwhile. Uh, so yeah, that's all right. Production-wise, um, I need another floor for one. Um, I feel like I'm, hold on, where is, am I operating in a lost at the moment? Yes, yes I am. Profit is, is going down. All right, I do need to, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I do need to fire you, sorry. Um, there we go. Does that reflect immediately? Not quite. I'm only at a 30% operating margin? That's ridiculous. So now that should, that should gradually, my profit should go up gradually become positive oh here we go it tells me right here I'm making 62 63 all right good uh, a day not awesome but oh man that's so ex that stuff so expensive what's this paint I haven't messed with this at all oh what do we got research complete ionizer Woohoo! and the agglomerator beautiful so now Scientists. Uh, let's see. What can we get you to do? Alternative delivery, basic auxiliary. Uh, so that let me do the creamer and advanced processing. Open new opportunities for machines. Mix, rearrange, or otherwise adjust the basic structure of our drugs. Hmm. I'm thinking I should go with the alternative delivery. Uh, and I can get advanced processing. 
it's in, which okay we then we get the autoclave and the cryogenic condenser which this one uh cuts the concentration in half so that can be huge and this one doubles the concentration again huge adjustments that would be much much easier to make you know large adjustments to the drug concentrations national headquarters Laser ground for researching new infrastructure projects. I don't feel like I need that in this this challenge, this short scenario. Oh man, this is taking me a while though. Okay, so let's just throw these guys on here for now. Oh, I do have an upgrade point. Um, process costs. I can reduce the processing costs for one of these machines. Um, I feel like it doesn't make a huge difference. I guess I do have a few dissolvers, but... Oh, pill printers. Pill bonus? What? Makes it more expensive. That doesn't... What does that do? Let's do, let's do that. Alright, so we, we did that. What does that mean? What does that make these pill printers do? What do you... Process time is two, okay. Increases combined value by 23. So I don't know, it's just a higher quality pill or something? I don't know. Anyway, let's go check out our cures. So now, I could actually do the alleviates insomnia, right? Upgrade with dissolver. Okay for antihistamines, the relaxants. So if we go here, uh, I'm gonna have to buy this. And then, wow, that that's a tiny little factory area. So then I can, you can see I have these little ex connections so I can able to expand other things. Whoa, look at all those ports next to each other. All right, so let's, we're gonna do the alleviates Insomnia, right? That's what I said. Ooh, combat liver disease. How do we get there? Um, oh, okay. Oh, but we need a catalyst for that. That might not be. Eases asthma. Okay, let's go with the alleviates insomnia. So we need a dissolver. We need to get it to four or six concentration. And it's whatever the antihistamine is. Antihistamine, right? Antihistamine. This one. Import you. All right, belt. Well, actually, so we need to... Concentration of four to six, and we're at nine. Okay, so we can get to six. Now we have the ionizer. Easy. Look at that. Boom. That gets us down there. And then we use a dissolver. Cool. And that'll get, um, let me go ahead and set up my pill printer set up right here. Beautiful. Um, so we've got, alleviates insomnia, it needs to be 11 and we're at five. Oh, yeah, okay, sorry, yeah, it needs to be, right, that's 11? I think that's 11. All right. Um, so we need to go to the agglomerator, which one there and one there. I think that should do it. Let's get those drugs flowing through it. What am I even making? <laughs> Insomnia. All right, cool. So that's gone. Oh, we're one short. So we're, we meet the criteria for that, but we need to go... <laughs> Wait, this drug's got a combined effect of making you fall asleep and inducing nightmares. Wow. Oh, that's... <laughs> oh, that's great. That's great. All right, so we need to add a, an evaporator. So, okay, cool. Actually gonna go.
There we go, like, oop, like so, and like so. Beautiful. So that should do it. So let's watch, and there you go, you can see both of those lighting up. Excellent. Adding a ton of value. I'm just gonna wait for my uh, pill printers to get going. Very nice. A little blue pill. All right. <laughs> Whoa, bro. Whoa, bro, night terror. <laughs> oh, gosh. Alternative deliveries. Research is complete. Excellent. Oh, that's... Oh, so I can do the creamer now. Reduces the strength of side effects in drugs. It also has a low process time. Oh, reduces the strength of side effects? Oh, that's... I thought that was... I did not know that was what it was for. Oh, what's this? Rather than starting medication. Ah, oh, demand is falling! That's garbage. Alright, let's do the creamer. Uh, reduces the side effects. Ah, man, I need to wrap this up. Um, so I've earned 73,000 so far. Oh my gosh, I need to I need to pick it up here. I'm low on cash though, but we are bringing in money faster. 219 a day, so that's good. This is a nice little production line. It's just a little zigzag across there. And I have an extra port. Look, I'm so e space efficient in building my factories that like there's, there's just nothing else for me to do here. Um, let's go, let's go over here next. Have to decide what we want to build. <sighs> um, and actually, this has been so long that uh, <laughs> apparently running at normal speed, this takes this area takes a while. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this off. I'm I'll finish up, so I'm gonna have another video at least. Um, so if you enjoy watching me play this, um, you know it's a pretty cool game. I really enjoy it. Like I say, it's a nice, simple tycoon type game. Let me pause here. I don't want to lose my production time. Okay, sleep friend. Oh, that is far sub sub substandard naming there my my friends that the sleep friend i much prefer the wilbro night terror <laughs> oh god let's take a look at this real quick this is the last thing we'll do e minus oh my gosh so our cough remedy our cough remedy severely needs a reducing of the side effects that's ridiculous that is ridiculous Ridiculously bad. Theirs is almost as bad, though. Oh, their antihistamine is an A? Ours is only a B plus. <laughs> okay, fine. That's that's fine. And then our... I, why are they going for the exact same stuff as me? Shouldn't they have different ingredients? Oh, well. Anyway. Uh, so as I was saying, thanks for watching. If you are enjoying the series, definitely throw some likes on the video, and I'll keep going. I'll go through all the challenges if you, if you guys are interested. Um, I'm going to play through them at any rate, but if no one cares, I may not record every single one. Um, so yeah, I'll see you all in the next episode when we'll finish up this challenge, try to make a million bucks, and see what other crazy drugs we come up with.